I wanted to invent a barbecue that had all of the benefits of char grilling over some hot coals, but also the ease and speed of gas. And this is it. It's called the fusion, and it's exactly because of that. It fuses together a modern technology of ignition, but with all of the benefits is a good old charcoal fire. We love baking a fire, hearing that crackle, getting that whiff of smoke from the charcoal and that wonderful char grill flavor you can get from a real barbecue. However, we also have had enough experience of the fire going out, numerous attempts to try and relight it, not working. If there's a gust of wind stopping that, taking the fire out, then you've got all the smell from the fire lighters and from the lighter fluid. Also, it just takes time. This cuts all of that out because of this little beauty here. It's a stroke of genius. Fast flame ignition system. All you do is take the grill off, put your charcoal onto this perforated tray, and then press the button. And through an ingenious combination of a fuse that's sparking off and a heating element which generates heat at the same time, that combination turbo boosts the charcoal to readiness. You can have this ready to cook in 10 minutes. That, to me, is fantastic. You also get an unbelievable amount of heat from this. As well as that, if you want to do a spit roast chicken, maybe a leg of lamb, a whole fish, you can, because these basically form the rotisserie. You can see the side here, you've got markings, one, two, and three, so you can just twist and adjust the height, which means you can move the meat closer or further away from the flame. The motor for the rotisserie is actually housed in this support. No one else has ever managed to do that before. And this side here, we've got the actual rod. It's got a retractable handle just so it can actually fit inside the housing. So these forks slide onto the rod. The great thing about these is this here. Very simple. It's a clamp. It just secures it in place and you haven't got any hassle of flapping around with the silly little screws. It just pop the end of the rod into there. Handle on this one. The cable for the motor slides out like that. And that's it. Press the button and off you go. It really is that simple. If you've got a flat apartment and you've got a balcony terrace that you can barbecue on, the barbecue can just come off the stand, it can sit on a table, it can sit on the floor. But then the stand turns into your table. So it's very good if you're confined in space. Just combining the ease of a gas barbecue in terms of actually getting it set up and fine, but all the benefits of cooking over charcoal to get the best out of the food you cook. It.